Ever wonder how you can build your own stock chart like the one you see in trading apps like Yahoo Finance or Robinhood? It seems simple, but behind the scenes there are billions of data points being collected, analyzed, and aggregated in order to power these kinds of visualizations. This time-based data is sometimes referred to as time series, and if you're looking to process extreme amounts of time-based data points, consider RavenDB, the open-source, high-performance NoSQL document database. First, what is a time series? Well, a time series is made up of data points indexed by time, typically high frequency in nature. Time series data can be inconsistent, coming and going at any time, like when a device comes online and then goes offline. Time series data could come from IoT devices, equipment data, analytics, and market data. Could you store these data points within a document database or as rows in a relational database? You could, but this won't scale. Storing data like this will quickly devour your storage and make your client code do more work to aggregate the data. To overcome these problems, you need a solution designed for scale. There are several databases dedicated to storing time series efficiently, but RavenDB is the only database where you get time series support and a fully featured NoSQL document database. If you're looking to simplify your enterprise architecture, look no further. RavenDB offers some advantages over other database engines thanks to its safe by default design philosophy. First, RavenDB is a fully ACID compliant database, and time series storage is no exception. You will never lose critical data you're trying to write. Concurrent writes and deletes of time series data and ultra-high frequency scenarios will never conflict, even when replicating across a cluster. By comparison, InfluxDB is the closest product that guarantees concurrent writes, but concurrent deletes can lead to an inconsistent database state. Both Graphite and Prometheus make no guarantees, so it's possible to lose data cached in memory during a node failure. RavenDB's Voron storage engine was custom built to be fully transactional, so you will never run into inconsistencies with creates, updates, or deletes, even with high frequency concurrent operations. Another key difference is consistency, meaning after a change, can you immediately retrieve the most up to date results? When working with a single time series, all operations are immediately consistent, including aggregations. The only time RavenDB is eventually consistent is when aggregating across multiple time series. By comparison, most operations in InfluxDB are eventually consistent, besides writes, which are guaranteed. Similarly, Graphite and Prometheus are all eventually consistent database engines. Many databases are fast, but RavenDB is both safe and fast. In a case study with Rakuten Kobo, we tested how RavenDB performed with their 1.3 billion document dataset on a Raspberry Pi. It was able to handle 500 queries per second, all served under 200 milliseconds in the 99.9th percentile. Even in a budget cluster consisting of three 8-core 32-gig RAM servers, RavenDB outperformed the competition by 60 times, achieving 30,000 reads per second at the 95th percentile level. That budget hardware represented a savings of 80% if Rakuten were not using RavenDB. When it comes to time series, RavenDB saves you even more money. There are several features that help you reduce storage costs. First, time series data is stored in an efficiently optimized data structure and has multiple compression levels on disk. Second, you can configure rollup and retention policies which will downsample historic data. For example, when storing stock prices, we only need high resolution data for a very short time, so we can roll up into 5 minute buckets and set a weekly retention period. We can then further define larger buckets to keep for longer time periods. These policies are processed when data is ingested. Different retention policies can be set at a database level or for all documents within a collection. Alongside rollup and retention policies, you can even name time series values. For example, when tracking prices, you can assign a name to each of the values which allows developers to write clearer and less fragile code. Time series data can also be managed within RavenDB Studio. Once a time series has been associated with a document, the raw entries can be viewed and edited in the UI. You can even plot and chart that data. Remember, issuing a query against a single time series always returns the most up-to-date results. For example, you can change the different time windows you want to bucket data on, and the results will still come back quickly. Common aggregations like min and max are aggregated in advance, so these queries are extremely efficient. When you want to query for data across time series, such as returning the latest stock price and the most recent company earnings, you can use indexes which are eventually consistent and built in the background. Finally, how does your time series data get into RavenDB? 
Along with the Studio Management interface, you can send data using the Time Series APIs offered in client SDKs such as .NET, Node.js, Java, Python, and Go. If you're looking to integrate more seamlessly with existing products in your environment, Telegraph is a plugin-based ingestion agent. Support for Telegraph will be available very soon. Are you curious to see how dealing with Time Series works in practice? To answer that, we've built a demo application that showcases time series support in action by tracking the trading price of Bitcoin inspired by the popular Robinhood trading app. The app displays the latest pricing data and you can interact with the chart to display prices at different points in time. The data can even be aggregated across different time windows. You can find links in the description below for walkthroughs that explain how to use the time series features that we built into the demo app. If this is the first time you've worked with RavenDB, sign up for the self-guided bootcamp that covers all the basics. We hope you join the other businesses that trust RavenDB to solve their biggest data issues. Visit ravendb.net and request a live demo today. We look forward to seeing you.